Hello there lovely viewers and welcome to another Daisy Beginner video by myself, GPUK. Today I thought I'd cover stashes. Get it? On one of my previous videos I'd covered base building. But what if you don't want to build a massive base? What if you just want to hide some of that precious loot somewhere in a forest for next time you die and start over again? In this video we'll go over all of the containers, I might have missed one or two, so feel free to drop a message in the comment section below if I have. And some tips on where are great locations to stash that precious loot. But before we go on, my last videos have pushed me that little bit closer to 100 subs. So if you'd like to help out, hit that sub button and let's get started. So in order to stash items in Daisy, you're going to need to get hold of the Shovel of Death. Starting from left to right, we have the following containers which can be stashed. A sea chest, a dry bag backpack, a dry sack, a teddy bear, a protective case, an ammo box, a first aid pouch, a cooking pot, and a wooden crate. We also have a barrel, which you can't stash underground, but you can still stash it, and that's in one of my tips. So to start with, take the container and stuff it full of loot, the stuff that you want to keep for the next time that you start a new life, for example. Then, find a location to bury your container. Yes, in this example, it is terrible. Do not place it right outside of a town. With a shovel equipped, you will have the option to bury that loot. And there you are. Your container is now stashed underground. You'll be able to tell in future where it is, hopefully you'll remember, by the dark patch of dirt. If you ever want to dig up the loot at a future time, let's say that you start a new life, find a shovel again and you'll have the dig up option. Complicated. Here are two places which I love to use when I'm burying my stashes. The first one is under a tree, not next to the tree, under a tree. First, cut the tree down, place the container on the exact spot where the tree is, and bury it. When the server restarts, the tree will be back in its normal position, and the buried loot will be hidden underneath the tree. Excellent. The second one is for the barrel. I always hide my barrels in a lake or in the sea. Take the barrel in your hands and walk into the sea or the lake until you are up to at least chest height, the, the height of the barrel, and drop it. The barrel will not be visible, but if you go into the sea or the lake again, you will see that you can still loot and place objects inside the container. And that's it. Nice and simple, an easy way to stash loose underground, and hopefully those two tips will come in useful for you in your next trip on DayZ. As always, like and subscribe if you enjoyed the content, and until next time, goodbye.